It looks like we're kicking things off here live in the ECW arena in Dallas, Texas with the baddest woman on the planet, Miss Money in the Bank, Ronda Rousey. Now she is making her way out here. Remember, she has the briefcase. Whenever Rousey feels like it, she can cash in that briefcase for an ECW Women's Championship match. Remember, Rousey run that briefcase. A couple months ago at the Great American Bash pay-per-view. So whoever wants to... Whoever is champion will have to look over their shoulder every five minutes for the baddest woman on the planet. The baddest woman on the planet, Ronda Rousey, says she will be watching that Dakota Kai and Sonya Deville match very closely. And if Paige interferes, she may cash in here tonight. And we're getting ready for our first match of the evening. As here comes the legend, a Hall of Famer to the ECW brand. Here comes the homicidal, suicidal, genocidal. Death-defying Sabu. Sabu is making his return here to ECW. Right here tonight, live in Dallas, Texas. And this first matchup is going to be an extreme rules match. Well, not really extreme rules, more of no holds barred, no disqualification. Whatever you want to call it, there's no rules in this match. And Sabu is great to see him still in pretty good shape after all the stuff he's been through in his ECW career. This man is looking to bring home a W here tonight. But it's not going to be easy. But Sabu doesn't care about easy. He'll take all risk. Whatever it takes. To walk out here as the winner. Let's 
Sabu patiently awaits his opponent. As the crowd is on their feet, and they should be, because it is the return of the wrestling machine, Kurt Angles. Kurt Angles returned to ECW last week. Telling Randy Orton that he was coming for a championship he never really lost. And if anybody remember, Kurt Angle was the ECW Heavyweight Champion. He lost the match. He lost the championship in a triple threat match. He wasn't even pinned. He was injured at WrestleMania, so he was unable to compete. But now Kurt Angle is back in ECW, and he's looking to regain the ECW Heavyweight Championship. And last week, he told that to Randy Orton, and he left Randy Orton laying in the middle of the ring. And he also let Randy Orton know that he's coming for that championship, and he's coming for it in two weeks at Hell in a Cell. But right now, Kurt Angle must focus on the homicidal, genocidal, death-defying Sabu. And there's the bell, and here we go. Both men looking to go at it. And there's Sabu quickly with a bridge. And now a kick to the back. Jawbreaker by Angle. Angle, belly-to-belly -belly suplex to Sabu. Tossing him across the ring. And this is our first match of the night, by the way. And Kurt Angle with a couple right hands. Now back suplex to Sabu. And Kurt Angle is fired up. And the ECW universe is loving every minute of it. Sabu just got headbutted by Angle. Angle tossed Sabu against the ropes. Went for a clothesline. Sabu ducks. Sabu now with a right hand. Another right. Picks him up. Drops him down. Knee into the ribs. Shot to the chest. And now, belly to belly suplex. By Sabu. And now Sabu is just on the attack of Kurt Angle. And like we said, what a sight to see Sabu back in this ring. No, no, Sabu now going after the leg of Angle. Remember, there's no rules. Anything is legal. Sabu has Angle up, but Angle with the elbows to the face and now one to the back of the head. And Angle now dragging screw to the leg of Sabu and now Kurt Angle going after the leg of Sabu. And there's a kick to Sabu's face, but Sabu reversing with another kick. And the big leg drop across the throat of Kurt Angle. Sabu, right hand. Sabu swinging that breaker. The crowd is on their feet for both men here. And Sabu tosses Kurt Angle back inside the ring. Oh, kick to the midsection by Angle. Angle running belly to belly again. Still to come tonight, we have Ricochet going one-on-one -on -one with Cassius Ono. We have Sonya Deville. Taking on Dakota Kai in the number one contenders match. If Dakota Kai can win, she will get her shot at Paige for the ECW Women's title in two weeks. We just heard from Ronda Rousey a few minutes ago saying that she could cash in that briefcase here tonight live in Dallas, Texas. And there's the suplex now by Kurt Angle. We also have that big number one contenders tag team match later in the night. Keith Lee is in action. And oh, there's a running knee. And another running knee. And now rushing leg sweep by Sabu. Sabu now going up to the top rope. Sabu looking to fly here. The leg drop off the top rope across the chest of the angle. And one, two, is this it? Kurt Angle kicks out at the last second. Sabu almost put away Kurt Angle right there with that leg drop off the top rope. And now Angle shoves Sabu off. Sabu blocks the right hand though by Angle. And there's a big clothesline by Sabu. 
Kurt Angle rolling to the outside trying to catch his breath. Sabu goes after him and that's a German suplex on the floor. Nice German by Kurt Angle and the fight has been taken to the outside now. Tossing to the steel barricade goes Sabu and now another belly to belly suplex. It's like Kurt Angle he's not going to waste any time he's going under the ring. He has a kendo stick. Went for a candlestick shot. Sabu rode out of the way. But there's the shot now to the head. Now Angle tosses Sabu back inside the ring. Kurt Angle looking under the ring again for another weapon. He has a chair now. But no, Sabu stops the chair. And belly to belly angles again. Kurt Angle again. And now there's the stump to the chair. Oh no, wait a minute. The camel clutch, the camel clutch is locked in. Kurt Angle is trying to fight out of it. I don't think Sabu has it in all the way. And Kurt Angle slides out, trips Sabu. And there is the right hand. Sabu with a shot to the back of the knee though of Angle. Takes him down into an arm bar. Sabu applying the pressure. Kurt Angle rolls out of it. Angle went for a close on spine buster by Sabu. And Sabu is really taking it to Kurt Angle right now. Kurt Angle reversing those with an arm drag. And there's the big headbutt to the face into a DDT. Angle goes for the cover now on Sabu. One. And only a one count. Sabu gets the shoulder up. Sabu rolls to the apron. Angle has the steel chair. Sabu ducks the chair shot. But he don't. He moves out of that one. But he doesn't dodge that one. That was one right to the head. And now. Wait a minute. He shoves the chair back in the face of Kurt Angle. Sabu. Kurt Angle reverse. Kick to the back of the knee. Angle slam. I don't think Kurt Angle got all of that. But there it is. The. Angle slam. I think Sabu used some of the ropes to protect himself. You can see Sabu bleeding from the forehead a little bit. Angle now has the chair in his hand. And there's a chair shot to the chest of Sabu. And then he went for another one. Sabu knocks the chair out of Angle's hand. And now Angle's bleeding from the forehead and face plant by Sabu to Angle. And this could be it. One, two, it's over. No, Angle gets the shoulder up. And Sabu is arguing with the referee. He believes that was over. And now, oh no, there it is. The camel clutch locked in. You can see the blood pouring from both men's foreheads. And Kurt Angle looks like he's in trouble. Wait a minute, Kurt Angle at the last second fights out of it again imagine Kurt Angle making this big comeback and taking the loss here tonight and now oh, there's a belly to belly Sabu rolls to the outside and Angle goes to follow him Angle dives off the apron with a cross body and both men are down and out on the floor I know Kurt Angle has the kendo stick that's a shot to the ribs now a shot to the back and another shot. And another one. Oh, Kurt Angle got the kendo stick again. Looked like he was going for another shot. Sabu reverses shot to the ribs of Angle. And now Sabu with a shot to the back of Angle. With the kendo stick and another shot. And another one. Wait, Angle blocks the kick. Shot to the knee. Angle elbow to the arm. And Sabu... And Angle fighting on the edge of the ramp here. Sabu tosses Angle on the side of the ramp. On the steel. And there's a high knee to the face. You see that big bright light in the way. We can't see all of it. It looks like Kurt Angle. He's stepping away from the light. And he's going to go get a. What is this? The steel steps. He's looking to hit Sabu with the steel steps, and there he does. Nails him right across the face. Now the steel steps to the ribs. Oh no, Kurt Angle. 
Picking up Sabu now. Angle talking to Sabu. Letting him know that this is almost over. And Sabu throws Angle back inside the ring. And there's a close on to the back of the head. Angle rolls to the outside. And look at this. Angle has snapped. It looks like Angle is taking apart the announce table. And Sabu is going after Angle. And oh, there's a right hand by Sabu, but Angle tosses Sabu back inside the ring. And Angle was thinking about something. Catches Sabu belly to belly again on the floor. Angle now has the purple steel steps in his hand. Looking to clock Sabu with them. And Sabu moves out of the way, but Angle nails him across the face with the steel steps. And now he went for a shot to the back, but no. Sabu takes the steel steps out of Kurt Angle's hand. Tosses Angle back inside the ring. Sabu now back inside. Sabu went for a run and knee. Kurt Angle move, but Sabu with a right hand. Sabu going for a belly to belly. No. Take down. By Kurt Angle. Angle going up to the top rope. Angle's looking to fly. Angle with a big frog splash off the top rope. To Sabu and now Angle with right hand. Oh no, there it is. Angle slam. He got all of it. One. Two is over. Sabu got shoulder up. How did he kick out of that? Angle cannot believe it. Angle goes for the cover again. And Sabu again kicks out of the Angle slam. And now Kurt Angle has the steel chair again. Angle went to swing the steel chair. Sabu knocks the chair into Kurt Angle's face. Sabu closes on to the back of the head. Stunt to the back. Now he's looking to finish Angle. Angle reverses kick. No belly to belly by Sabu. Angle went for Sabu went for a close on Angle Dutt. Scoop slam. Sabu rolls to the floor again. Kurangle's telling Sabu to bring it and Sabu goes back inside the ring. Sabu! A shot to the head of Sabu. And a shot to the ribs. That man Diddy T on the steel chair. Sabu could be out cold. Well, I think Kurt Angle trying to put the icing on the cake. German suplex. Another German suplex. It looks like he's going for the third one. Sabu is down and out. He isn't moving. And now Angle picks him up. Another Angle slam. Why? Two, three. Kurt Angle picks up the win in his return here tonight against Sabu. And there's some of the replays. That's the Angle Slam he hit earlier. Angle didn't get all of that. But that's the other one that put Sabu away right there in the middle of the ring. Well, no, that was the second one. We thought it put him away. But Sabu was able to kick out of it. But Kurt Angle delivering... The three German suplexes and then a final angle slam again. And Kurt Angle picks up a win. And I hope Randy Orton is watching somewhere because Kurt Angle is coming for the ECW Heavyweight Championship. And we can we could be looking at what's gonna happen in two weeks at Hell in a Cell. Oh no, there's Orton with a snake attack. Oh no, set him up. No, RKO, the RKO, the current angle. Randy Orton, the ECW champion is sending a message to Kurt Angle after what happened last week. And oh, wait a minute, Angle's getting back up. Orton's not done. Oh no, he hits him with the belt right between the eyes.
we're back and we're getting ready for our next contest as here comes Keith Lee Keith Lee made his ECW debut two weeks ago when he defeated one Curtis Axel of the B team Keith Lee an amazing athlete not too many men his size move the way he do the man moves like a cruiserweight and he's looking to pick up another W here tonight as he's about to take on Bo Dallas of the B team and all he wants is to soak in these victories and have the whole ECW universe bask in his glory I mean look at the size of this man Keith Lee a powerhouse a monster I hope Bo Dallas knows what he's getting himself into taking on this man I mean did he not see what Keith Lee did to his partner two weeks ago and here comes the B team Bo Dallas being accompanied by Curtis Axel and ladies and gentlemen just moments ago we heard Candace LeRae call out Sasha Banks saying that she wants to go one more time with Sasha Banks in a false count anywhere match in two weeks at hell in a cell but tonight it's about the B team and Keith Lee and you heard Candice LeRae also say next week she wants to go one on one with Bianca Belair of Team Bad but right now we're getting ready to start this match Keith Lee is ready Bo Dallas is ready the ref rings the bell here we go and there's a huge clothesline by Keith Lee now Keith Lee delivering a couple of right hands to Bo Dallas Keith Lee, look at this. Look at Keith Lee catches him. Belly to belly suplex. The power of Keith Lee. Now Keith Lee tosses Bo Dallas into the corner. Went for the big splash. Dallas moved out of the way. Look at Bo Dallas. Wait a minute. Catches him. DDT by Bo Dallas. And, and now he looks like he was going for another one. There's the power of Keith Lee just shoving Bo Dallas down. No way, man. Bo Dallas bounces back up. Catches him with another DDT. Where's this Bo Dallas been at? But Keith Lee now with some light, some left hands. But Bo Dallas stops him. There's a hard right. Oh, no. Catches him again. Another belly-to-belly -belly suplex. And now look at this. Curtis Axel distracting Keith Lee. And now Bo Dallas is taking control of this match after the distraction from his tag team partner. Oh, Keith Lee just quickly knocks down Bo Dallas again. And oh no, he's going to catch him again. Another belly to belly suplex by Keith Lee taking Bo Dallas to Suplex City. Now has Dallas up, drops him. Real furs into the ropes. Picks him up now. Kick. DDT. And look at the kip up. Look at that kip up. By Keith Lee. The athleticism. And now he's going to put Bo Dallas face first. Now he picks Dallas up. Scoop slam. And there's the big moonsault. Lee 
has Dallas up again. Slams Dallas down. Keith Lee going up to the top rope. Look at this moonsault by Keith Lee on. Dallas scouted it. He put the knees up. Now look at Bo. Going for a net breaker. No, Keith Lee shoves him off the power of Lee. A form, another form. And no, no, look at Keith Lee. Tosses Bo Dallas to the other side of the ring. Picks him up. Throws him over the ropes. Keith Lee doesn't seem happy now. Tosses him back inside the ring. Keith Lee going up to the top rope. Look at this. That moonsault. Inverted moonsault, it looks like, by Keith Lee nailing Bo Dallas. Dallas side steps now. Dallas, look at this. Skull crushing finale to Keith Lee. Shades of the Miz. Remember, Bo Dallas and Curtis Zaxo used to be part of the Miz to Ross with the Miz. Look at that springboard. Sunset flip. One, two by Keith Lee. No, Bo Dallas rolls him up. One, two. Keith Lee kicks it out, and that was scary. As Bo Dallas rolls to the outside of the ring, and he doesn't know what to do. He doesn't know what it's going to take to put down Keith Lee. But Dallas tries to go for another shot. Quickly taken down by Keith Lee. Lee. For Bo Dallas with a forearm. Now, Keith Lee with a clothesline dropping Dallas. Picks him up. Snap there by Dallas. Dallas goes for the cover one. Two, it's going to take more than that to put down the big man. But Bo Dallas has found a way to hang on so far. With the help of Curtis Axel. And there's an elbow. And another big elbow by Bo Dallas. And here comes the third one. Now that dropped Keith Lee. And now Dallas. Net breaker. Keith Lee rolls to the apron. Dallas must continue to stay on this man. Well, he has Dallas by the head. Drops him up on the ropes. Keith Lee telling Dallas to get up. Dallas tries to go for the attack. And there's the big splash by Keith Lee. Now Keith Lee a big Spawn Buster dropping Bo Dallas. And Dallas could be in trouble now. Although Keith Lee has him up. The Jackhammer. One, two, three. Keith Lee picks up another win. This man is limitless. He picks up the win over Bo Dallas. Here's some of the replays. And the match. I mean, we give credit to where credit is due. Bo Dallas lasted longer with Keith Lee than we imagined. He has somewhat of a strategy, but in the end, the jackhammer put down Bo Dallas. And Keith Lee continues to impress, continues to have these fans bask in his glory. And what another win. Who will be next to step up to Keith Lee? And now it is time for our women's competition of the night. Here comes Sonya Deville representing Absolution. As Sonya has one goal here tonight, and that goal is to stop Dakota Kai. She has had marching orders from Paige earlier tonight that she should not allow Dakota Kai to pick up the win because Dakota Kai wants a shot at the leader of Absolution's ECW Heavyweight um, Women's Heavyweight Championship. That is currently being held by Paige. 
And now Sonya Deville, the fighter, the right hand to absolution is on their goal to make sure Dakota Kai doesn't get a shot at her friend, her partner, her leader, the anti-diva Paige. Sign the feel. Just warming up. And here comes the woman that wants a shot. Just one shot. And that's the leader of Team Kick, Dakota Kai, who we saw last week call out Paige and said, Look, Paige, you have defeated a lot of women for that ECW title. You have to put in a lot of work. But there's one person you never defended that title against. And that was me. And coming off, the, off of a big win at Bash at the Beach, when she pit Ruby Riot and took out the Riot Squad, Dakota Kai is looking to position herself as the number one contender for the ECW Women's Championship. Referee rings the bell, and here we go. Saint Deville quickly grabs Dakota Kai. And now look at this. Look at Saint Deville just rubbing the forearm across the face of Dakota Kai. And there's a stump to the back. And Deville now going after the arm. Deville isn't wasting any time. Trying to end Dakota Kai early. And there's a kick. And look at this full speed running knee to the ribs. And now the knee to the back. Now Dakota Kai going for a suplex, I mean a scoop slam reversal by Kai, but DeVille with the side kick, and Dakota Kai with a running big boot to the face. Sonya DeVille with the MMA background, Dakota Kai with the striking background. Both women love to deliver kicks, and Dakota Kai going up to the top rope. Went for the drop kick, missed. There's the tie up now. Shows off the veal. There's the right hand. There's a kick to the leg. And there's the chops and the punches by Dakota Kai. The strike and the fury of Dakota Kai. Drop it down the veal. And this crowd formerly behind Dakota Kai. Kai now running. Bulldog. Goes for the cover on the veal. But DeVille kicks out before even a one count. Kai now with another right hand. Reversal now by DeVille. DeVille with the lock in the headlock. Scoop slam by DeVille. Now Sonya DeVille, look at this. Takes it down, locking in the headlock on Dakota Kai. Kai rolls out of it. The bill firing up now. There's another strike and another one. Dakota Kai knocks the bill to the outside of the ring. And now Dakota Kai is hyping up the ECW crowd. And she dives off the apron and a big forearm to the face of Sonya DeVille. And now tosses DeVille into the side of the ring. And now toss DeVille into the barricade. There's a couple strikes. By Dakota Kai. And now tosses DeVille into the ring post. And now slams her face first into the ring post. And down goes Sonya DeVille. And now Dakota Kai. Wait. DeVille reverses. Tosses Dakota Kai back inside the ring. Here comes DeVille. DeVille went for a kick. Nope. But now she catches Dakota Kai. Snap suplex. Saying DeVille very underrated. Here on the ECW division. And women's division. There's the strikes now. By Dakota Kai dropping. Saying DeVille to a knee. Went for a running boot. 
DeVille moved out of the way. Snap there, and there's a shot to the back of the neck of Kai by DeVille. And now DeVille, look at this. Quick roll up into the to the triangle. She has a triangle choke in now. The cut of Kai is struggling to get out of it. As DeVille continues to apply the pressure. Oh, no. There's a couple of strikes. No reversal. By DeVille tossing the Dakota Kai on the apron. Now slams her back inside the ring. Dakota Kai is down and out. One. Only a one count. As Sonny DeVille going to have to do more than that to put down the captain of Team Kick. The woman who brought the fight to Paige last week. Slapping Paige right across the face. And now look at this. Look at this transition into a a wrist lock by Sonya Deville. As Dakota Kai is struggling to get out of it. And Dakota Kai fights out of it. But holds the wrist. And now went for a roll up. Oh, but knee to the face. By Sonya Deville. Wait, Dakota Kai with the right hand. Fighting back. Reversal by Deville. Tossing Dakota Kai. On the apron. And now knocks her out to the floor. Wait. Dakota Kai tossed Deville back inside the ring. Dakota Kai going up to the top rope. Missile drop kick. Connects. Going up to the top rope again. Look at this, the big stomp to the chest. The double knees to the chest. One, two, no! Dakota Kai thought it was over there. Kai rushing leg sweep. Still to come. We have the number one contenders tag team title match. Well, not tattoo title. Oh, what a, what a move by Dakota Kai. We have that number one contenders match for the ECW Tag Team Championships. The New Day versus The Bar. And we still have Ricochet. Tornado DDT off the apron. I'm out the top rope. There's a one, two, kick out. We still have Ricochet going one-on-one -on -one with Cassius Ono here tonight. I don't know. Blocked by DeVille. And now blocked by Dakota Kai. Dakota Kai, look at this. The kicks. The strong kicks by the captain of Team Kick. Dropping Sonya DeVille. And there's another kick. Another one. Here comes the scorpion kick now to the face. Dropping Sonya DeVille, who is down and out. Dakota Kai now picks her up. Kai went for another strike. No. DeVille running. Trip. Running knee. <coughs> DeVille with that sliding kick to the knee. Dropping Dakota Kai. And now Kai is trying to fight back. We know how much this win means to Dakota Kai. If she can pick up this victory. She will be the number one contender. For the ECW Women's Championship. Now Dakota Kai. Look at this net breaker off the top rope. Now picks up Sonya Deville. Drops it with another Russian leg sweep. Oh no. Dakota Kai. Full speed ahead. Here it comes. The big boot. The foot wash to the face. And now the running drop kick in the corner. Down goes Deville. And this could be it. One, two, Sonya Deville kicks out. Dakota Kai can't believe it. And now Deville, the running kick to the face. Now another kick. And look at Deville with these strikes and the clothesline. Oh, jaw breaking now by Dakota Kai. I mean, Dakota full speed ahead. She delivers her finisher. That's it. It's over. Dakota Kai's no more contender. No. Sonny DeVille got a rope break. 
And what is it going to take? Dakota Cox tries to go for the cover again. One, two. But now DeVille kicks out. What is Cox going to have to do to put down DeVille? Dakota Cox going to the second rope. That's a big frog splash. One, two, no. So you DeVille kicks out again. Now Dakota Kai, shot to the knee, but no, look at this, look at the power of DeVille, slams her down. Now DeVille stumps on the arm, and now a knee to the back again of Dakota Kai. And now there's some more strikes, and another clothesline by DeVille, and this could be it now, wait. Dakota Kai shoves her off. Dakota Kai still has fight left. Takes DeVille down again. Going for the cutter. Reversal by DeVille. And now a super kick to the stomach. Drops her down. Knee to the back. A running knee to the back of Dakota Kai. Kai using the ropes to pull her up on the outside. Now DeVille drops Dakota Kai off the apron. DeVille goes to the outside. Wait, Kai reverses, tosses DeVille back inside the ring. Slides back in. Wait a minute, Dakota Kai running. Bulldog! Oh no, she's setting her up again. Get to the midsection full speed. She hits the finisher. Folding DeVille, that's the second time. One. Two, three, Dakota Kai has done it. The captain of Team Kick is now the new number one contender. And there's the big foot wash. There she goes, delivers her finisher right there. There's that medium frog splash. But now the captain of Team Kick, Dakota Kai, after delivering her finisher for the second time, is now the number one contender for the ECW Women's Championship. She will meet Paige at Hell in the Cell. And there is Paige on the stage. And she doesn't seem happy that now Dakota Kai is the number one contender for her ECW Women's Championship. And she will meet Dakota Kai in two weeks at the Hell in the Cell pay-per-view. As Paige is upset and she isn't impressed could Dakota Kai be the next ECW Women's Champion now we're getting ready for the tag team number one contenders match as we're getting ready to hear from the New Day and here they come. Big E. Xavier Woods. The New Day. Making their way out here. Dancing. Using the power of positivity. Like I said, when you look at these two guys, you think, man, they're just happy to be here. But these two guys are two of the best guys on this roster in that ring and we know their brother Kofi Kingston was traded to WCW Nitro while Xavier Woods and Big E were brought to ECW and now they have a chance to fight for the ECW Tag Team Championships in two weeks at Hell in a Cell if they can win this number one contenders match right now. As New Day says, they rock as usual. The fans are chanting it. And now they have to take on this team. Cesaro, the Celtic, and the Celtic warrior, Sheamus. One, two, 
three. Bella. And there is the bar. One of the most decorated tag teams on this roster. These guys have all the tools to take them ECW championships, tag team championships, away from the Viking Raiders. If anybody can match up with the Viking Raiders, it's these two guys. And they're looking to position, position themselves as the number one contenders. But in order to do that, like we said, they must win this match. Because one of these teams will take on the Viking Raiders. It will either be the bar or the new day. And the Swiss Superman, the cyborg Cesaro, what's his health? What percent is this man in after having that match last week? That no holds barred match with Aleister Black. Those two guys went to war. But now, it's about getting back to business. And that's the tag team business. And there's the bell. And here we go. We're kicking things off with Xavier Woods. And Cesaro, look at Cesaro quickly now, suplexing Xavier Woods. And Cesaro with a European uppercut. Went for a running uppercut, missed. Xavier Woods, snap suplex by Woods. And Woods stomping away on Cesaro. New day, the bar. And disc is forearm by Xavier Woods in a right hand. Now Woods with another snap suplex. Woods picks up Cesaro. Cesaro blocks and there's a clothesline. Cesaro went for the stump. Catches Xavier Woods with a standing drop kick. On the cyborg. Note reversal by Woods. Tosses Cesaro on the apron but Cesaro with a right hand. And now Cesaro's going up top. Looking to fly. And there's a double axe handle. To Xavier Woods. And there's the tag. In comes Sheamus. His partner who we haven't seen. In a couple of weeks. Have, has returned. And he's looking. To just destroy Xavier Woods right now. And there's a couple of shots to Xavier Woods. Look at Sheamus. Slamming Woods. Real, real first into the ropes. And now knocks Big E off the apron. And now Sheamus hammering away on Xavier Woods. Reversal by Woods. Down goes the ref. Tosses Cesaro to their corner. I mean, Sheamus into their corner now. Takes, tosses Sheamus again, and there's the tag. In comes Cesaro. Cesaro, look at the strength. Dropping down Xavier Woods on his knee. Real first. Gut first. And there's a running belly-to-belly -belly suplex by Cesaro. But Xavier Woods kips up and flying forward. The quickness of Woods. Now Woods working on the arm of Cesaro. Woods stumps on the back of Cesaro. Stumps on the back again. Bat breaker by Woods. Now Woods dropping down Cesaro who falls back. Woods went for another discus forearm block by Cesaro. But he catches Cesaro with an arm drag. And let's swing in DDT. Cesaro trying to shake off the cobwebs and tag in Sheamus. He is crawling. Crawling. Is Woods going to stop it? Cesaro uses the ropes to get him up. Reversal. Couple of shots to Xavier Woods. 
dropping woods to one knee, inverted backbreaker. Cesaro tosses Xavier Woods into the corner. There's the tag. Here comes the double team by the bar, dropping down Xavier Woods and tossing him into the turnbuckle as Xavier Woods went flying. And there's a the German suplex by Sheamus. Nice combination. And Big E desperately looking for a tag. And here comes Big E. Sheamus went for a knee. Big E moves. Big E. German suplex toss. No, there's the clothesline by Big E. And another clothesline. And now the atomic stretch locked in on Sheamus. Sheamus is in pain as Big E continues to apply the pressure. Cesaro pleading for help. Cesaro fights out of it. Now Cesaro is cheering on Sheamus as he continues to stomp out Big E. Now Big E reverses, tries to go after Sheamus. Blind tag by Xavier. I mean by Cesaro. There's a suplex to Big E. And now a European uppercut stunning Big E up against the ropes. Look at this. Springboard. European uppercut by Cesaro. Cesaro going up to the top rope. Looking to fly here. Big splash, but Big E gets the knees out. Not so fast, Cesaro. And now Big E. Belly to belly suplex. Big E just waiting for Cesaro to get up. Cesaro run and drop. Get to Big E. And what a night we had so far. We, we had Ronda Rousey tease of money in the bank cash in we had S Sabu taking on Kurt Angle in one heck of a battle and Angle quickly being attacked after the match and was nailed with an RKO by Randy Orton and it comes Seamus now Big E turns his attention to the Celtic Warrior and there's the tag and wait a minute they're setting it up 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 down down that can be it. One, two, no. Cesaro breaks it up. The Cesaro drop kick to Xavier Woods. Now he tosses him up, and there's the European uppercut. And now Woods and Sheamus are both down. They're both out of it. Both men are trying to get back up to their feet. Xavier Woods. Look at that. A roll up into a face plant to Sheamus. Woods now goes for the cover. One. Sheamus quickly kicks out at one. Sheamus went for a run and shoulder tackle blocked by Xavier Woods. But there's the power now applied by Sheamus in a running knee to the face of Xavier Woods. And a knee across the face. Now has him up. Tosses him into the corner. Couple of elbows to the face. And to the side of the head of Xavier Woods who drops like a sack of nickels. And, the, and Woods now ducks and going after the leg of Sheamus trying to break Sheamus down. There's a tag. Nope. Blocked. Stopped by Sheamus, but there's a tag there, and Big E comes in. Sheamus choking away on his every was in the corner. I'm not sure if he saw the tag by Big E. Big E has Sheamus up and slams him down. Big E picks up Sheamus. 
Looked like he was going for the big end and blocked by Sheamus in a double axe handle to the face. And now tossed over the ropes onto the apron. And now the punches to the chest of Big E by the Celtic Warrior. And Big E falls to the floor. And Sheamus goes after him. Sheamus continues the attack. Sheamus, nope. Reversal by Big E. Big E tossed Sheamus back inside the ring. Big E. Look at this. Look at the power of Big E. slamming him down. And he just holding Cesaro. I mean, Sheamus like he's a kid. Now a belly to belly suplex to Sheamus by Big E. And now Seamus and Big E continue to trade shots. And there's the big closing clothesline by Big E. Uh, but there's Seamus with the attack on Big E and continues to stomp him out. There's the tag to Cesaro. The Swiss Superman's back in. Belly to belly suplex by Cesaro. Trip by Big E. And now Big E went for a clothesline. Cesaro ducks. Cesaro right hand to Big E. And now the snap suplex by Cesaro. Cesaro has Big E up. Tosses Big E into the corner. There's the tag. In comes Sheamus. And the double team tosses Big E into the turnbuckle. And now the German suplex. Seamus has Big E up. Toss Big E into the corner. There's the tag. The bar continued to trade tags. And look at this double team tosses Big E into the corner. And now the bar double kick. Dropping Big E to the mat. Now Cesaro goes for the cover, but Big E foot was on the ropes. And now Cesaro with the right hand. And now Big E, German suplex. Well, belly to belly suplex. Oh, now look at this. The power back body drop by Cesaro. I meant to Cesaro by Big E and Big E tosses Cesaro into the corner. There's the tag. Oh, wait a minute. Look at this. Look at this move by the New Day. Oh, what a move. And Seamus doesn't like that. Seamus came in, but there's the hip toss by Xavier Woods. And now Seamus with a reversal. Tossing Woods on the apron. And there's Sheamus now beating on the chest of Xavier Woods. Bro, bro, bro. And down goes Xavier Woods to the outside. Tosses Woods back inside the ring. And now Sheamus... It's just up on the apron, on the turnbuckle, turning the fans as they're booing. And now Seamus has Woods up, an Irish backbreaker curse. And there it is again. The combination of the backbreaker curse to Xavier Woods. And now tossed into the corner. There's the tag. Oh, wait a minute. They're setting it up for the finisher. There's the big boot to the face. One. Two is over. The bar's going on. And now Big E breaks it up. Cesaro setting it up. He's looking to end this. 
drops Xavier Woods. Oh no, he locks in the sharpshooter. And the sharpshooter's in, but Woods was about to tap, but Biggie broke that up. Cesaro going for the cutter, blocked by Xavier Woods. Woods kicked to midsection, swinging that breaker. Woods fired up now, goes for the cover. One, two, no. Cesaro is able to kick out. Cesaro went for a running draw kick. Blocked by Xavier Woods. Tossed into the corner. Cesaro running European uppercut in the corner. Drops Xavier Woods. There's a shot and a German suplex by Cesaro. Put Xavier Woods back up. There's a drop kick. I don't know if he got all of that. Picks him up. Reversal by Cesaro. Shoved off by Xavier Woods. Woods tosses Cesaro to the corner. Cesaro blocks. Tosses Wood into the corner of the bar. But Xavier Woods catches Cesaro with a big boot and a clothesline to the back of the head. Xavier Woods fired up. New day rolled through on a roll. He catches Cesaro with the on a roll and it's over. No. Cesaro was near the ropes. Forcing the ref to break the count. And now tosses Cesaro into the corner, but Cesaro reverses. There's a blind tag by Big E. And now Big E with a forearm. Stunning. Cesaro, oh no, big ending. He's going to deliver the big ending. And Cesaro is down and out, but Sheamus continued to break up the account. And now look at this. Look at the power of Sheamus catching Big E up. Crucifix power bomb. Is that it? One. Two, Xavier Woods breaks that up. What's it going to take for the bar to put down the New Day? The New Day still has fight left in him. Big E dropped. Sharpshooter in. Big E grabs the ropes. Cesaro. Tosses Biggie into the corner. Tag. With his double team. Into the corner again. Another double kick. Dropping Big E. Reversal by Big E. Puts up Xavier Woods. Went for a tag. Nope. Caught. Slam down out of the corner. But now Sheamus reverses with a couple of right hands. Look at this. Sheamus the power. Right there. Choke slam. Sit down. That's it. One. Two. Big E gets the shoulder up. And these two teams are going to war right now. To determine the next number one contenders. And they're putting one heck of a fight on right now. Xavier Woods. Super kicking Sheamus. He's calling for New Day Rocks. There's the tag. And in comes Cesaro. And there's the running drop kick. To Rey Mysterio by Ces I meant to Xavier Woods. By Cesaro. Cesaro going up to the top rope. Cesaro looking to fly. Went for the big splash. Blocked by Woods. Woods now. Went for a kick. Blocked. Clothesline by Cesaro. Dropping Xavier Woods. And there's the uppercut again. And Woods could be out of it. And that's one. Two. 
three. The bar picks up the win over the New Day. And now the bar is the number one contenders for the ECW Tag Team Titles. And there's the up, up, down, down earlier by the New Day. There's the uppercut right there. To Xavier Woods. And there's that big Irish curse bat breaker. But in the end, the bar have done it. They are now the number one contenders. And they're looking to take them ECW tag team titles away from the Viking Raiders. That's main event time as here comes Cassius Ono. Making his way out here. The knockout artist. You can tell he isn't in the mood. Especially after last week when he was defeated by Ricochet. That's why we're having this match here tonight. Because it was Ricochet and Matt Riddle defeating Cassius Ono and Sami Zayn last week. Okay, Shizona wants revenge. And he says that in order to get that revenge, he needs to knock out the ECW Intercontinental Champion, the one and only Ricochet. And he patiently awaits here for Ricochet. And now you hear it. Here comes the one and only the Intercarnal Champion Ricochet making his way out here. As the crowd is fired up here. It's Ricochet we know this whole thing started with him and Sami Zayn. When Sami Zayn attacked Ricochet two weeks ago backstage. Ricochet got somewhat of revenge last week. Even though Sami Zayn wasn't the one that ate the pinfall. But now. Like we said it brings in Cassius Ono. Who isn't happy. And he. Sh he shouldn't be. He shouldn't be happy. The man got embarrassed last week. And here we go. And there's a tie up. And there's the headlock locked in by Ricochet. Ricochet now working on the. The wrist. No reversal. Cassizano goes after the wrist. Ricochet, shove Ricochet off of him. And there's the back suplex. By the knockout artist. And a big boot to the face of Ricochet. So we just got word right now next week. And there's a big drop kick. And look at that. Next week it will be the ECW Women's Champion Page. Teaming up with Mandy Rose. Her absolution teammate. And oh, wait a minute. Pow driver by Castrozono to Ricochet. And the crowd doesn't like that. Castrozono looking to stomp on Ricochet. Ricochet blocks the kick and drops him face first. Castrozono to his knees. DDT by Ricochet. Standing there, shooter star press by Ricochet. And now, Ricochet, nope, blocked headbutt by Cassius Ono. Ono now, swinging that breaker, taking down Ricochet. And look at that, Cassius Ono just getting warmed up. He wants to make Ricochet pay for defeating him last week. In between the ropes now, swinging that breaker. Can you imagine if? Cashizono picks up a win. That could put him in line for a future title shot. And there's a strike to the back of Ricochet. But Ricochet eats that. And there's a European uppercut. Stunning Cashizono, but doesn't knock him to the floor. And now Ricochet tosses Cashizono to the outside. Ricochet has that look in his eye. 
Is he about to fly? He's about to fly. Full speed ahead. Ricochet suicide dive to the outside. And down goes Cassius Ono. And the referee continues to count. Ricochet slides back in the ring. Cassius Ono goes to follow him. Uh, look at this back suplex by Ricochet. Ricochet now has Cassius Ono up. Tosses him into the corner. Running European uppercut. Elbows to the face. Tossed him into the ropes. 619. Look at this. Springboard European uppercut. Nice con Nice combinations by Ricochet. There's a big chop, not a big boot. A running big bicycle kick boot. By Cassius Oh no, no. He's going for the big sit time. Taking down Ricochet. And there's a huge chop dropping. The one and only. And now the big boot to the face. Picks him up. Another big boot to the face. Picks him up. Nope. Ricochet blocks that boot. Drops him down. Right hand. Stunning him. Look at this. Cutter. Plants him. Cassizano trying to pull himself back up again. Ricochet. Tosses him back outside the ring. Cassizano trying to pull himself up. Ricochet keep going for a second. Suicide dive, and there it is. Taking out Cassizano. And now Ricochet is all fired up. Ricochet tosses Cassizano back inside. Face first into the mat. And there's a running knee to the side of the head. Now he's back in the ring. Look at this. Like he's going for a springboard 450. Miss it. He overshot it. And there's a super kick to Cassizano. Cassizano's in trouble. Ricochet got caught. German suplex. And down goes Ricochet. Cassizano stomping away. Running, swinging, net breaker. That has Ricochet by the head. Kick to the back of the spine. Oh, European uppercut by Ricochet. Cassizano catches him. No, 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 no. Another one. Another power driver. And the crowd is booing. Cassis Ono right now. Cassis Ono now. That's Ricochet up against the turnbuckle. There's the big chop. Turns him the other way. Placing Ricochet on the top rope. Hangs him upside down. And there's a stump to the chest and Ricochet drops. Cashes on him, picks him back up. Ricochet, super kick, drops. Cashes on him. Ricochet, starting to get some light. Running head scissors. Tossed over the ropes onto the apron. There's a right hand. Look at this. Springboard. DDT on the side of the apron. Toss back inside the ring. We also can confirm to you that Bianca Belair will take on Candice LeRae next week in a running swing in that breaker. Cassizano back in control of this match. Now look at this. He's working on the arm of Ricochet. He's looking to stomp on that arm. And ah, oh, he stumped on him. And now look at this. Look at the power. Tosses Ricochet on the other side of the ring. Ricochet rolls to the outside. Cashes on and goes out there to face him. And Ricochet with a running net breaker onto the floor. I'm back on the apron. Ricochet went for a diving elbow drop. Cashes on and moved out of the way. 
Oh no, catches on. No, no, no. He tosses Ricochet into the side of the ring. And Ricochet could be down and out after that one. Has him up now. Ricochet tosses him back inside. Ricochet going up to the top rope. Looking to fly. And catches him. And now Ricochet. Springboard. Cutter. Catches. Catches on him. He's down and out. Uh, Ricochet. Going for the people's moon song. And there it is. Now he's looking. Springboard 450. No. Catches on a move. There's a chop to the throat. Oh, no. Nah, he's setting it up. Set it up. Here comes the spinning kick to the face. And that's it. Ricochet's out of it. It's done. One. Two is over. Ricochet kicked out at the last second. And Cassius Ono cannot believe it. He's setting him up now. He's looking to finish Ricochet. He knows he's only steps away. Ricochet ducks. Kick to the back of the knee. Ricochet. Back suplex. Oh no. Cassius Ono's in the drop zone. Elbow drop to the chest. One, two. Cashes on him, kicked out. Ricochet pits him back up. Ricochet tosses him into the corner. It is. Tucks his head in. Super kick. Cashes on him is out. Ricochet going to the top rope. 640. Bam! He nails it. That's it, one, two, three, Ricochet picks up the win. As he defeats Cassius Ono here tonight. Some of the replays. Cassius Ono, you can see we're bleeding from the forehead. There's the elbow drop to the chest. And right here, the 640. Putting him down. There it is from a different angle. And Ricochet can celebrate here tonight. And Ricochet continues to celebrate. And wait, there's Sami Zayn! Sami Zayn with the cheap shot on Ricochet after the match. And Sami Zayn once again continues to sneak attack. The ECW Intercontinental Champion. Now Sami Zayn is, is leaving the ricochet. He's trying to get back up to his feet. And oh, wait a minute. Sami Zayn has a ladder. Oh, no, no. Oh, my gosh. He just hit ricochet right between the eyes. And now he drops the ladder. And Sami Zayn, no. What is he about to do now? No, no, no. No. Go slam on a ladder. And you can see Ricochet's back just cracking against the steel. 